Well, it's been a little more than five years since the state of Michigan took over Belle Isle. And you might remember the decision was quite controversial, one that many in the city of Detroit were not happy about. So we asked Nick Monticelli, go get a status update. So this question came up about how Belle Isle is doing five years after the fact. And we figured, well, there's really no better place to go than Belle Isle on the 4th of July when this place is packed with people who can answer that very question. Because it's 4th of July and we're bicycling. I love Belle Isle. Whether they came to Belle Isle for exercise, for the sights, the food, or just for fun, <laughs> most people say on this Independence Day, it's a much better place than it was five years ago. It's a lot safer than it was. It's nice and clean, nice and family friendly. Um, not all the rowdiness. I really like the way they've cleaned it up. Dwight and Sandy Kirksey were here for a bike ride and also love the park, but also say. Uh, it's a little bothersome that you don't see as many young uh, black kids around as you used to before, and they were having fun too. They're afraid Belle Isle isn't as accessible as it once was. Maybe even public transport, you know, shuttle buses that would help people and like seniors to come out here and enjoy the, the beauty of Belle Isle. But it's still a cleaner and safer place to make memories, even when only one side of a couple knows why they're here. We were going to visit his brother who lives downtown and he's like, oh, well, he's, he's dilly dallying. Let's stop at Belle Isle. I'm hungry was my first response. But Grosse Point native Adam Kinnear was hoping this Independence Day would be his last as an independent man. I just got engaged <laughs> five, ten minutes ago. <laughs> you had no idea? I had no idea. No idea. And what better place to start a new life than a place that got one too? I mean, you got the skyline right over here. The fountain, I heard it's a been reconstructed or something, cleaned up. So, yeah, it's beautiful. I'm Belle Isle, Nick Monticelli, Local 4.